Today's Sage 50 tip is a really simple one, but it's a huge time saver and I can't believe how many people overlook it. We're going to be looking at this view related transactions link. It does exactly what it says. It helps you find any transactions that are related to whatever transaction you're looking at right now. Now if there is nothing related to it, like on this sales order right here, the link disappears. But anytime it's there, you can click on it and you can see transactions linked to it. So in this case, this sales order was converted from a quote. We see it right there. We can double click on it. We can see the quote. Or if you'd been starting from the quote, you can click on the view related there and you'd see the sales order. And uh, let's go to another sales order. In this company, we've turned on the option to auto create purchase orders for dropship sales orders. So when we click the view related transactions link here, we're going to actually see the purchase order that was generated when this PO, or when this sales order was saved. So we can double click on that and it opens up the purchase order and again from there you can click the view related transaction links again and here you, you can see the sales order that's related. You can also see the purchase invoice. So if you double click on that it opens up the uh, the purchase invoice and you can just keep going on and on like that, uh, going through all the related transactions. And here we're back at the view related for our sales order. So there's the invoice that it was turned into, so we can look at that. There's your invoice. We know from the stamp over here that it's paid in full, but if we want to know more about that, again, we can hit view related transactions. There's the receipt. And we can see what check number it was paid with and uh, that it was paid with other invoices at the same time. And uh, so you can see that the, the uh, V-related transactions is a huge time saver. Um, and I just I can't believe how many people overlook it. Hope you find it useful.